The Winkes Laboratory is one of our key uh, collaborative partners uh, at Chalmers University. Uh, we have been working with uh, this team for many years uh, and we really enjoy the uh, environment that uh, is created in this consortia. We are really proud to have GQN as a partner in Winkvist Laboratory. Uh, the aerospace industry are working with really tough requirements and that is of course a challenge also for us. So uh, the research agenda set out by the Winkvist Laboratory is part of our uh, agenda of uh, the target that we have to investigate and find new technical solutions to, to advance problems. Uh, we all, always seek to find new ways to, to solve challenging tasks and also implement new methods and technology into our daily business. Um, this has been part of our journey for many years together with the Winkers Laboratory and we are looking forward to, to continue that journey together with them. So in this collaboration we have been working uh, for instance on how to identify the stacking of uh, small components building up uh, an advanced structure. Uh, but we can also see some other challenges in order to cope with all the requirements necessary to be met on uh, uh, flying hardware. We try to identify methods of breaking down and setting targets on each requirement and follow up, up that uh, type of uh, challenges. Uh, and that has been worked out uh, with new methods uh, developed by the Vinquist Laboratory. I think there are probably three main results coming out of this. Uh, a key one is of course creation of knowledgeable people. So PhD students has been developed through the Vinquist Laboratory and are employed by, by GKN as we speak. Uh, there is also a clear development of uh, training courses in relation to the different methods that we have been developing in, in the laboratory, which has been adopted by a number of uh, people inside our company. But there is of course also specific methods that is the edge of what can be uh, achieved uh, today uh, in this type of uh, um, uh, research field uh, and we are always in the chase of finding the best uh, technology out there um, and that has been a key success uh, factor for for us uh, being part of uh, Winkers laboratory uh, uh, I think we see evidence of that inside our company today. One example of what we have developed through the Winkers labor laboratory is methodology for how to prepare advanced 3D printing uh, traces of our robot systems. This has been uh, done by uh, manual work basically before and now we actually have a computer tool that support us uh, directly with transferring uh, the necessary geometry into a, a robot model. Uh, this is also uh, built into the IPS uh, software solution, which are used here today. By introducing this method, we can transfer our models from a computer down to the robot system with an increased speed and reduction of the time from uh, drawing board to product tremendously. So how has this collaboration uh, contributed to the United Nations uh, development goals? Well, as you, we all know, the aviation industry is one key source to emission. Uh, and the challenges that we see is, of course, how we can contribute by reducing those emissions. One key element of that is, of course, to introduced more advanced solution in propulsion systems and by being able to quickly move in with new technology uh, Vinquis laboratory have proven to be a source of new technology that we can adopt into this journey. 